Bangladeshi women have been rearing chicken at the backyard from time immemorial. Chickens often get diseases as the traditional chicken rearing practices don't always follow. Hygienic and sanitary measures and the expected gain the keepers are threatened. The Food and Agriculture Organization of the United Nations FAO and Government of Bangladesh have jointly implemented a project called Improving Food Security of Women and Children by enhancing backyard and small-scale poultry production in the Southern Delta region with a financial grant from the United States Agency for International Development, USAID. The project has imparted training to 2,900 women from Borishal and Kulna districts on hygienic and biosecure poultry rearing and human nutrition. These women have also received an impute package of one biosecure chicken shed, ten improved variety chickens called Shonali and other necessary materials. The project has developed a cohort of vaccinators who are now actively engaged in vaccination of birds to prevent them from major diseases. As the farmers comply the biosecurity measures, the mortality in their flock has dropped and better egg and meat production is observed. Eventually, the families are now consuming more eggs and meat than before and gaining some extra income by selling eggs and chickens. The traditional chicken coops are not well ventilated and farmers are used to keep them dirty for months together. Therefore, the project provides a different parts of poultry shed to farmers which farmers can easily assemble to make a complete well ventilated coop. The shed is six and a half feet long, three feet wide and four and a half feet high. With a floor space of about 20 square feet, the shed can easily accommodate 20 birds at night, reared under the same scavenging system. The side walls of the shed are made of GI wear net, which makes the shed well protected as well as allow the free flow of air and sunshine. The bamboo mat roof of the shed makes it comfortable around the air. The beneficiaries use polythene sacks as floor mat and clean the droppings and other dirts that the morning accumulated overnight. Farmers use side cotton to protect the shed from stormy weather and rain which they can fold and unfold easily. তারপর বস্তাগুলো প্রতিদিন ধোয়া ধোয়াই করে রোদে শুকাতে দিছি তারপর মুরগিগুলো খাবারের জন্য ক্যাপিটেরিয়া ব্যবহার করছি এবং ছোট বাচ্চাগুলো পালনের জন্য খাসা ব্যবহার করছি ডিম ফুটানোর জন্য হাজাল ব্যবহার করছি আগে একটি মুরগি থেকে বছরে 40টি ডিম পেতাম এখন 120টির মতো ডিম পাচ্ছি আমার বাচ্চাকে আমি ডিম খাওয়াই এবং আমরাও খাই এবং কিছু ডিম দিয়ে বাচ্চা ফুটাই এবং অন্যগুলো বিক্রি করি বাচ্চা মুরগি বড় হলে আমরা মাংস রান্না করে খাই এবং অন্যগুলো বিক্রি করে দেই এবং যেগুলো ভালো সেগুলো থেকে পালার জন্য কিছু রেখে দেই টিভিটা ব্যবহার করে সাবান দিয়ে ছয় দাপে হাত ধুই খাবারের পুষ্টিমান বজায় রেখে খাবার রান্না করে পরিবারকে খাওয়াই ইন এডিশন অফ সাপোর্টিং ফার্মার্স টু ইমপ্রুভ প্রোডাকটিভিটি অফ ব্যাকইয়ার্ড ফ্লকস দ্য প্রজেক্ট হ্যাজ কন্ট্রিবিউটেড টু দ্য ইমপ্রুভমেন্ট অফ এগ প্রোডাকশন অফ স্মল স্কেল কমার্শিয়াল ফার্মস এজ ওয়েল The project supported a total of 40 small commercial chicken farms, establishing biosecurity system in four unions of Uzirpur and Babugonj Upazila in Borishal district. Dr. Selina Fruza, Secretary, the Minister of Fisheries and Livestock, and Mr. Mike Robson, FA representative in Bangladesh, were present at the handover ceremony of 40 farms. Now farmers are following biosecure farming system and getting eggs from their flocks. These farms are working as showcase of biosecure commercial farming and acting as motivator for the other to follow the example set by them. The farms are there by meeting the nutritional needs of the families and community and bringing fortunes to farmers.
from the egg cells. The project is about um, biosecurity um, in the backyard poultry system in the south of Bangladesh. Um, it was designed originally at a time when disease problems were quite uh, present, such as avian influenza. Um, another of the uh, concerns of the project was to try and improve nutrition. Um, poultry and eggs are a good source of uh, protein and this can uh, obviously boost up nutrition. The, uh, the project has been running for a couple of years now and has really introduced some new innovations into uh, the backyard poultry system that make it less prone to disease. Um, productivity has gone up quite considerably. We work very closely with the Department of Livestock Services. One of the surprising findings was that people did not necessarily uh, eat the eggs or, or even the chicken meat that was involved, but they actually uh, sold uh, that uh, produce and uh, very often they've used that, the money that they've made to uh, pay for uh, school or medical or even buying other kinds of food. So the benefits have been, in terms of nutrition, direct but also some indirect benefits. There are some significant lessons for other parts of Bangladesh in terms of the poultry housing and how to keep the, the chickens clean, how to make sure they're well fed and how to make sure that they are not subject to disease. And these are lessons that the Department of Livestock Services will take to other parts of Bangladesh in future.